On Thursday, a 4.1 magnitude earthquake occurred near Dover, Delaware. There were no reports of injuries or damage, but it was felt as far north as here in western Massachusetts. Earlier in the week, there was a small 1.6 magnitude earthquake centered in Boxborough, Massachusetts, Monday evening. Back in 2011, a stronger earthquake occurred in central Virginia. That one was a 5.8 and was felt from Maine to Georgia and caused between 200 and 300 million dollars in damage. Some buildings in downtown Springfield were even evacuated as a precaution. Over the last few years, there have been some smaller earthquakes that have occurred here in southern New England. In 2015, a number of small earthquakes were felt in eastern Connecticut and Rhode Island in an area called the Hope Valley Shear Zone Fault. Some people 22 News Talk to remember feeling earthquakes here in western Massachusetts. There was one quite a few years ago that I felt in the house I could actually feel the, the, you know, things shaking a little bit, but that was about it. It was, it was almost like a truck rolling by. Back in 85 it was the day my mom was getting married and I was supposed to get up early and I felt my bed shaking and thinking that the train was going by and then I realized there's no train <laughs> where I'm living so I couldn't figure out what it was and later I figured uh, I heard about it and it's like that's what that was. According to the U.S. Geological Survey, most of the earthquakes that occur in the east are usually miles deep in bedrock that can contain faults that were active in earlier geological eras.